Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an incredible day. Today I have another haul. I'm sorry, this is life. I need help. I have a lot of things that I should be saying right now, but um, instead I'm gonna say, let's just get started. Okay, so I got stuff from Calvin Klein. Huh? I got the coveted bralette from Calvin Klein. There is like no support in here. It's literally just fabric, but it's beautiful and I love it. And I'm so excited to wear it. And I also got the matching underwear, but like we don't have to talk about that. The band is like my favorite thing ever. And I know it's super trendy, but I don't know. Sometimes I like to fall into these trends and other times I don't. Right now I'm in one of those phases where I'm like, oh yes, I love all these things. I think it's Instagram. I honestly think Instagram is doing this to me. So yeah, I got these things and I just think it's really exciting, honestly, okay? I'm super stoked to try them on and to wear them and just be like, I'm Kylie Jenner, basically. Next, I went to a CCO, which if you don't know what a CCO is, CCO is basically where brands like MAC, Estee Lauder, um, Bobbi Brown, I think, Smashbox, Clinique, brands like that will send their overstocked items, I believe, to this store, slash they will send um, limited edition products to the store, things like that. So, I got something from the MAC section of the store and I am so excited. I don't know which collection this is from, if you know, which most of you probably know, I'm just not like that into MAC collections, um, let me know. But it looks like this, so it is this like hard case kind of deal, sparkly, has a little lady on it, super fun. But then when you open it, Jesus is saying to you, I think these are beautiful. These are five different pigments, and I've never been a big fan of pigments. I've never had an opinion on a pigment. I've always thought they're messy, I don't need them. For $28, you can get five pigments, and they had a few different ones there, um, and I just thought that this one was calling my name, honestly. It has really cool rosy tones. Oh my god, so pretty. I've used these two so far, the two lighter ones, but I'm excited to try them all out. So these aren't from the CCO, but these are from Sally Beauty Supply, and I just got more Demi Wispies. I am so excited. I love these Ardell Demi Wispies more than my life. Okay, not more than my life. Maybe equal to my life. Is that sad? That's sad. Okay, no. But I just think these are so incredible, you guys. I am wearing them right now. These are my like older pair that I should throw away. But I think these are incredible. These were like five dollars for one pair, which is kind of crazy, but I do reuse mine. I'm in love with them. They're my favorite lashes I've ever found, ever. Next, I went to PacSun. I went to PacSun actually two times. This was the second time I went, but apparently I'm showing it to you first. So first I got this shirt that I'm wearing, which is so nice. It has these like bat wing sleeves. Is that what they're called? I know what they're called, but I'm spacing. Um, they're like the super flowy sleeve and it's a lot of fun. And it has a little tie on it. I'm going to be kind of out of focus, I think. But it has a tie, and it's a little cropped, but it's nothing crazy. And I don't know. I really... Let's just do that, Brooke. I just really, really like this shirt. It has some, like, crocheting on the sides, too. Super, super cute. The whole store was buy one, get one, 50% off, I think. By the way, this is um, from the Kylie and Kendall collection, and it was $32, I think. Um, and then this was the other piece I got, which I really like. And I like how delicate the straps are and everything. It's really pretty. How much was this? This was $29.95. I got both of these in a medium. Um, I just, I really like this. I love how the bottom is very scalloped and like crocheted out. That's really unique to me. Um, but it's on a crop top, but almost because there is this illusion of skin and then not skin, skin and then not skin, it's kind of like, it is kind of cropped because you can see a little bit of your stomach, but it's not completely cropped. I don't know if that makes sense, but I like it. This was from the brand LA Hearts, and this is very wrinkly because I washed it before filming, but um, all of these kind of like button up, so it's really pretty. And then they have this like cold shoulder sleeve, and this is like a three-quarter kind of sleeve and it has these ties that hang down you could tie them you could just let them hang I like to let them hang I don't know and then I got this shirt um, and I think that these were all on sale or in like a certain section where you could buy one get two free I believe that's what it was which is always great oh my god they have so many good deals yeah so then I got this shirt which is kind of more boring um, it's just straight up a tank top but I think it's a nice basic piece to have 
Um, I don't know. I, I think that it's cute. I'm not like obsessed with it, but I don't hate it, you know? The last thing I got was also from LA Hearts, and it is this dress. The sleeves are a little bit kind of flowy too. It's really, really cute. I honestly think it might be a little bit more of a tunic kind of deal. I wore it as a dress. You can wear it as a dress. Just be very careful if you're tall. Next, I got some shoes from Adidas. Our apparently the Irish say Adidas. I don't know. What? Adidas? What are you saying? I don't think so. All the Irish people I met um, or I'm friends with, they're gonna be like, huh? What? What is she trying to make fun of us? I just think it's so weird. Irish people actually say Adidas. What? I got their superstar sneakers that everyone is obsessed with, everyone knows about, everyone wants. I mean, maybe not everyone wants, but they're very, very well known right now and I think they are so beautiful, like actually beautiful, and I just, I love them. I think the gold on the tongue of the shoe is really cool, and I think that this will look really, really, really beautiful. Um, oh yeah, I did buy the other shoe too. I think these will look really, really cool with the striped dress that I wore in my empties video that was pretty recent. I think that would look really nice with them. I'm just so in love. And from Marshalls, I got these. These are like fake L.L. Bean, fake Sperry shoes, um, or boots, I guess, that everyone also has been wearing, or at least people around me. I don't know if this is like as well known as the Adidas shoes, but I know that a lot of my friends have dropped one of them. I know that a lot of my friends have been obsessing over this shoe, and I got these at Marshalls for $16. They were on super, super clearance, and I really like them, honestly. I don't have any complaints with them. I guess maybe I have one small complaint. The bottom of this shoe is very, very flexible. So all I did was just get like a little insert for the shoe, which kind of helps a lot. And I think these are so nice. They're very, very shiny. I think they are beautiful, especially for $16. Why not? Next, I got this purse and it's really full right now because I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag right after this video. So I'm not gonna empty it out and then you know, throw things in it, be like, huh, this is what's in my purse, because that's not actually what's in my purse. But this is from the brand Anne Klein, and I got this little, like, palm, palm tassel kind of deal also from Marshalls. I know that hardware is different, but honestly, I don't really care that much, and I love this. This is about $40. It's obviously not real, but you know what? I don't really care. It comes with the big strap. It comes with the little arm straps. I just really like this bag. Um, I'm not going to talk about it too much because I'll talk about it more in the actual what's in my purse. I also got a wallet that kind of matches it. I mean, they're a little off, but they're pretty similar. And this is from the brand Guess. I love this so much. I think this is so nice. I'm not going to open it now. Like I said, check out that video. I'm so excited about this purchase. Lastly, I'm going to go through all of the makeup I have purchased slash been gifted recently. I'm super, super excited, so let's get into it. Um, the first thing I got was this BH Cosmetics Contour and Blush 6 Color Palette. I actually got this at Marshalls, which is really, really weird they had this, but they had this one and one that was a little bit more of a peachy tone, I think. These are so beautiful, so nice, so smooth. This contour is my favorite thing. These blushes are really nice. They are very, very, very concentrated though, but I can use this one or this one to kind of go over that blush and make it a little bit more neutral. So honestly, it's no big deal because if I'm gonna use one of these blushes and if they happen to be a little bit too much, I already have the palette open so I can just go for those two things. Next, I got this Wet n Wild Mega Last Nail Color. This is in Sugar Coat and it's just really pretty. I've been really into the delicate looking nails recently and I think that this will be beautiful on. I haven't done my nails yet, so once I do it, Maybe I'll post about it on Instagram or Snapchat, um, but I'll let you guys know what I think about this. It seems to be kind of sheer though, just by looking at it, so I'll have to let you know, but I'm excited if it isn't. I love these types of baby pinks. Next, I got this e.l.f., what is it called? Lip Lock Pencil, and this is in the color Clear. Mm -hmm. Basically, it is this clear, waxy lip liner. There is absolutely no color to it at all. It kind of gives something for your lips to hold on to, and I really like it. I also got this e.l.f. smudge pot. This is in brownie points. I have heard so many people talk about this and love it. So I decided to pick it up when I saw it at the Dollar Tree, 
and this is really 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 pretty you guys it looks like it would be a nice shimmery kind of color once you look at it it looks like it has a lot of dimension but honestly on my eyes it looks very matte which I'm not mad at <laughs> I also got this elf extra lip gloss this is in the shade Scott I've heard Andrea Matalano, I think that's how you say her name, talk about this a lot. And I like it, I think it's fine. I'm not a big lip gloss person, actually, if you know anything about me, I hate lip gloss. But I decided to get this because it would be okay for me for filming, because I like to sometimes have a glossy lip on for filming. And like I said, I normally hate lip glosses. This is one of the more comfortable ones that I have found, if I'm gonna be honest. So. Especially for the price tag, I think that's okay. Next, my friend Annie got me so many things from Ireland, and she is literally the sweetest person on the planet. She got me so many different, really cool Irish makeup products. European, I guess, makeup products. And I wanted to show you guys them. I'm so excited. You guys, if you live in Ireland or Europe or wherever, you can buy these products. I'm so jealous because they are so incredible. Oh my god. Okay. So the first thing that she got me was this Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum, and mine is in 52 Vanilla. Um, I actually was like, hey, if you ever see this, please, please bring this for me because I love this. Two pieces. Um, I bought it when I was over in Ireland last year, and um, I'm almost done with it. So that's what it looks like. I'm just so excited to use it. This is such a nice foundation, especially if you have dry skin. Um, it just makes everything look nice. It kind of smells good too because there are like berries in here or something. This is something I bought here in America, but I just forgot to show you guys. This is the e.l.f. Lip Balm Tint, and this is in the shade Grapefruit. So this is what it looks like. It's super chill. I like to apply this with a lip brush because I actually get a concentrated color with just my fingers. It's nothing spectacular, but it kind of felt weird at first, but then I'm kind of enjoying the texture of this. If you guys have these, I think you might know what I mean. They're kind of like a pillow on your lips almost. It's really strange, but I like it. She also got me this uh, Catrice Defining Blush, and this is in the shade Mandy Ryan. This is one of those blushes where you swatch it and you're like, Okay, it's a really light peach color. That's nice. When you put it on, it's beautiful. It looks like you're not wearing blush, but you are. It's just very, very natural. I just love this so much in my- oh, I'm so happy it's in my life. You have no idea. This is so incredible. Annie also got me this brow kit, Shape and Define, from Berry M. And it comes with an applicator and tweezers, which I have on my vanity right now, so they're there. But they're just there, you know? And oh, this is so cool. So it basically has like a white eyeshadow highlighting powder, a brunette, or I guess maybe more of a dark brown brow powder. And then it comes with this light medium brown gel. But oh my god, this is so, so nice. I like this highlighting shade so much, maybe a little bit too much. I just, I'm in love with this. I have um, these two on my eyes, or on my eyebrows, I guess, today. Now, you guys, I honestly might cry. I love this so much. This is from Sleek, and this is the face form in light. Oh my god. It comes with a matte bronzer. This is perfect to contour with. I'm wearing it right now. I hope it looks okay. And then it comes with a sh really shimmery highlighter, and it comes with a really shimmery blush. <sighs> I love this. When I put the blush on, it doesn't look like there's glitter on my face. It just looks like a nice natural glow or like a glisten. And then the highlighter, it looks incredible. These two together, I thought they may be a little bit overwhelming or something, but they aren't. They're incredible and I just love them. I have, like I said, all these on my face today. I'm so in love with this. If you guys have sleek around you, buy this. Just do it. Like, it's so incredible. Their eyeshadows are great and oh my god. Ugh. The next thing she got me was this Collection Lasting Perfection ultimate wear concealer. Mine is in warm medium. So she said if you have dry skin, which I do, don't put this under your eyes because it'll exaggerate that a lot. So I took her advice. It's not under my eyes, but when I do use this, I will put this on blemishes and it works pretty well. It is pretty full coverage. Lastly, this is a product that stole I've, like my heart, my emotions, my feelings, my everything. This stole me, okay? I'm obsessed with this. This is the Catrice Cosmetics Long Lasting Brow Definer. 
It is a little pen. It's like a felt tip pen kind of deal. It makes the beginning of my eyebrows look like hairs, okay? This is what I've been searching for for my entire life. We can actually buy this here in America too at Ulta, which there isn't really an Ulta super close to me, so I never go there. Um, so I never tried this before. I didn't even know it existed, honestly. But oh my god, this is incredible. If you want an eyebrow routine, let me know. I mean, I'm still horrible at doing eyebrows, but this product is incredible and it's making me have faith in myself that maybe they'll look okay one day. So you guys, that was everything I got in my haul. I think it was kind of a little bit bigger than I expected. I don't know. Um, I have just been so excited about all these products. I have just been waiting and counting down the seconds before I could show you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, give it a thumbs up or give me a comment down below. So thank you so much for watching and taking the time out of your day to hang out with me and chill and relax and live on the edge as they say, those crazy teens nowadays, you know? So please be sure to subscribe, come thumbs up and all that jazz. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Okay.